The holding technique is a technique I use for children pretty much from when they start to move, so about 10 or 11 months. I use it for things that are always a no. For example, in this house, I use it if a baby or toddler tries to crawl into the kitchen or if they crawl over to the fireplace and attempt to touch the fireplace because the fireplace is always going to be dangerous. Mummy says, Dara's not allowed to touch that. If you touch it, you're asking mummy to hold you. At that point, I will sit down and hold them. I go behind them so that if they throw themselves backwards, they're not going to hurt themselves. Mummy doesn't want to hold you, but you touch the fireplace, so you're asking me to hold you. And again, you hold your toddler like this, and then they get cross, like Dara's getting cross, and they normally go, Aah! and at that point, you let them go. Dara, that's electric. If you touch that, Mummy's going to hold you. Mummy doesn't want to hold you, but if you touch that, Mummy's going to hold you. And most toddlers will just constantly find something that you don't want them to touch to test you. Most of the time, if you've worked on the fireplace for 5, 10, 20 minutes, sometimes it can take 20 minutes before the child will listen to you, and they go off and touch something else, you need to just change the subject by distracting them with a toy, as explained in the toddler book.